What's up you guys welcome back to my channel my name is Nora and thank you so much for watching for today's video we are going to be jumping into my current winter nighttime routine kind of take you guys through what I've been doing every day after work uh, as always be sure to like comment share and subscribe also don't forget to follow your girl over on Instagram because you know we are growing the family on all platforms uh, so yeah as I mentioned I am just wrapping up work right now wrapping up some emails um, I did want to point out obviously I know I'm pretty dressed up in like full glam makeup and lashes we're in the middle of vlogmas so I am filming videos every day uh, so that's why I was a little bit dressed up because I was filming a video before this so just gonna wrap up this here and then head into my room to change into some comfier clothes um, I like to make sure I'm nice and comfy before I get started on dinner um, I had a pretty big breakfast and lunch that day so I wanted to keep it pretty light so just going to make um, a salad and some salmon. So just pulling out the spring mix, uh, gonna pull out a cucumber, some tomatoes, avocado, you know, a couple different ingredients, some pico de gallo. Just going to work in uh, to getting all of these ingredients out. Gonna start off with putting my spring mix obviously into the bowl, make sure I rinse that. Now, I, I'm, I'm gonna kind of, you know, call myself out a little bit here because you guys will see in the next couple clips. <laughs> Listen, I know I say I'm not a chef, but I promise you I can at least cut things. It is time for me to get a new set of knives because I honestly, it, they're just so dull and so old. I've had them for, you know, several years now. And I mean, they get the job done, but they're not as smooth and efficient as I would like. So if y'all know any good like knife sets, always remember I like something a little bit more aesthetic. Definitely leave that down below and let your girl know. So because I was looking back at this footage like, sis, why is your cutting looking so janky? So <laughs> definitely let me know down below what you guys use. Uh, just moving here into my tomatoes, rinse them off. Um, I thought I was gonna put two tomatoes in there because I, I honestly love tomatoes, but I ended up after just cutting up these and how I wanted them that, that day a little bit more wedged, um, I decided just to do one tomato. So I'm just going to add those in here. Now you guys will see in that container the water and there's like half of an avocado. I actually learned that on TikTok. So they say that if you don't use the entire avocado, you can just fill up a little Tupperware container cold water and put it in there. And as you guys can see, um, that has been in the fridge maybe a day and a half. Not, yeah, probably a day and a half, not exactly two days and the avocado looked great. So I would definitely recommend doing that if you find yourself not using all of it. Uh, tossing in some pico de gallo right now into the salad. I like a little bit of crunch and you can see there, don't mind the crazy children in my apartment. Um, I did show that uh, simply avocado dressing and listen y'all, don't come for me with my pan. It gets the job done. Your girl already asked for some new pots and pans for Christmas. <laughs> so just going in with the avocado oil spray from Pam and then just gonna add in my uh, salmon I like to go in just with Lowry's uh, you know the pepper gonna use a little bit of the parsley as well as some garlic powder nicely season my salmon I don't like to cook my salmon too too much I like it a little bit more on the like medium rare medium side but that's the way I enjoy it and that's dinner, y'all. Nice and healthy, okay? Nice and healthy. Just got some salmon and some salad. So going to head over just to my little counter to enjoy my food. I don't like to sit on my couch. Uh, you know, want to make sure I preserve that as much as possible. Do like to bless my food, and I just like to enjoy this and watch some YouTube. <laughs> Listen, I was enjoying that salmon. I also take this time to kind of just go through some of my YouTube stuff, make sure I am on task with any videos that I need to film, uh, make sure I'm on task for the day, and if I do need to rearrange anything, this is kind of the time I go through that as well. Sweet, 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 sweet. 
I am someone who likes to make sure the kitchen and sink is completely clean after dinner. Um, I don't use my dishwasher that much. I live alone, so I have no issues with washing my own dishes. <laughs> so I do do this every night after uh, you know, cooking, just making sure everything is tidied up in the sink and wanna make sure all the dishes are done. She got that drip, put it on me. Fuck that shit tonight, we getting no sleep. Let me make you feel something real. Yeah. She said that body shake, 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 shake. Got no time to waste, 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 waste. She said you don't pass your waist. Now, once I'm just about done pretty much with the dishes, I do like to just go back in and make sure I clean and rinse out the sink. Wanna make sure you have no smells lingering from there. And then I do like to jump in and just make sure I clean all my countertops and my stove. Um, I do a deeper clean on the weekends, mainly like Saturdays and Sundays, but I do at least like to go in with some all-purpose spray from 7th Generation, as I showed you guys there, and then also like to just go in with my Lysol wipes. Once I've finished with the countertops and the stove, I do just like to do a quick sweep just to make sure if there was anything that did fall on the floor while I was cooking, seasoning, anything like that, wanna make sure that is swept up completely. And uh, right here, you guys will see, we've got a, a pretty clean kitchen. Dishes, you know, will dry overnight and then I just let my pan soak a little bit. All right, and I had to tidy up this bathroom quite a bit because again, with Vlogmas, it can sometimes get a little bit out of hand and I did my makeup, you know, a little bit earlier in the day. So wanted to tidy this up just before, uh, you know, I jump into the shower. Wanna make sure everything is put back and put away. And then from here, your girl hops in the shower and, you know, does what she got to do. Uh, Got to make sure the lashes are off. Take all the jewelry off as well. Um, if you guys want to get a little bit more detail as to what I do use uh, in the shower, you can definitely check out my uh, skincare hygiene favorites and, uh, you know, kind of tap in there to see what I like. Um, I didn't show my full winter nighttime routine or nighttime skincare. I do have a video here on my channel already with that. So if you guys want to check in to that video as well, I'll have that linked down below for you guys. Uh, but just finishing up my, you know, nighttime skincare routine, heading back into the kitchen. It's about 8.50 now. My little nightcap, let me tell you, I don't really drink soda, but my little bubblies get the job done. And it wouldn't be a nighttime routine without Nora's diffuser going. So you guys know, love my Vitruvi diffuser. I set that up, get on the couch, and pretty much this is, uh, you know, the rest of my night. I just kind of sit here, finish washing up some YouTube, uh, jump into editing, and I'm usually in bed, ideally. I mean, Vlogmas has been a little crazy by like 11, 11.30. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Yeah, something yeah, real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just let that body shake, 